Hey, Connor here at Never Sink Farm, and uh, I was just doing some improvements over to the chicken area, so I was gonna let you check it out. All right, so a few weeks ago, we had a, uh, found a dead chicken. My kids found the dead chicken. You know, we're keeping chickens that happen, it's uh, part of life. But you wanna do your best to protect them, obviously, and so you can tell by how they died and uh, kind of what happened as to what kind of animal it is. And this is, you know, kind of odd because it was completely plucked. That's a hawk, right? A fox it doesn't really do that. It usually carries them away. You don't have much left. But this, it was just completely plucked. And so that was a hawk. And so hawks are one of the most difficult to try and stop. You know, some people put netting over the whole area or something like that. You know, we have a big pasture for them, so that, that's not really an option. But the hawk likes to perch before attacking the chicken. Preventing them from being able to perch easily around the uh, chicken area is a great way to stop them. And that, that's what I've been doing. And so far it's been working. The, the hawk no longer perches here. And there's these stainless steel kind of spikes. You know, they're, they're not sharp or anything. It just makes it so that the, the hawk doesn't want to perch, and they just slide into the bottom of, of a strip. You'll have one going in one direction and then one going into another direction. And, you know, obviously the hawk doesn't want to land on something like that. Right, because, you know, fence post is like the perfect place to chill out and figure out what you're going to have for dinner. So we get these things in. And then the only thing you need to do after that is just... Uh, for the fence posts, what I do is I just cut them with a grinder so I have a short piece that goes on a fence post so over here. And then I just screw them right on top of the fence post. And then if you have some long braces, right, then I just screw them on onto those, uh, just in a line. And that prevents it. Before we figured out a hawk, we did, we did lose two chickens, but we haven't lost any since that since uh, these started going in, and it's been working really well. And they're, they're very inexpensive, and from a distance you can barely see them, so it's not something that's really ugly. You can, they're all on these posts here, but you can't really even see them because they're so thin. That's just another way that keeps them safe. <laughs>